Hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück zu Let's Play Persona 4 Golden. So, dann gehen ja morgen unsere Examen weiter. Also versuche ich mal noch jeden Stern ein bisschen hochzukriegen. Ich habe irgendwie so das Gefühl, das wird ein bisschen eng, die Stats alle noch auf Maximum zu kriegen. Midterms Day 3. What is the Japanese name for Panda? Black and White Beers. Gut, korrekt. Which bird is falsely known for being cowardly in the English phrase to stick one's head in the sand? Ostrich. Läuft an sich alles eigentlich relativ gut so. Midterms Day 4 What was the name of the Vassan textbook that came out in the Edo period? Math Girl. What did Napoleon have invented? Glass Jaws. So, noch zwei Tage über. Which season is the adjective brisk a key go for? Ich glaube fall. Ja. What is dragon's blood? Uh, ja, plant resin. Der letzte Tag, da müssen wir jetzt ja nichts mehr beantworten. It's the last day of the exams. You answered every question with ease. The answers seem to be flowing from your hand. Uh, it's finally over. Hey, about question eight. Chi and Yukiko are completely absorbed in, re in reviewing the axiom. I pulled an all-nighter last night, so I'm ready to collapse any second now. I'm gonna head home. See you later. Yosuke left. At last, the long midterms are finally over. Today was the final day of midterms. Since you have no leads, you must wait until the criminal takes action. The long week of testing has finally ended. What will you do today? So, gehen wir mal runter. Okay, die sind halt alle nicht da. Und ich muss halt sagen, ich habe eben mal nachgesehen, wie man den Social Link von der Auto halt startet. Muss ich mal gerade hier sehen. Shopping District North. Das sollte dann entweder heute oder vielleicht auch erst morgen. Ich weiß es nicht genau. Sieht so aus, als wenn es erst morgen so wäre. Da müsste hier irgendwie ein Dude mit dunklen Brillengläsern rumstehen, die man dann halt anreden kann. Gut, das heißt dann, dass wir einfach wohl mit Freezer interagieren. Dann kriegst du wenigstens noch ein Skill. Oh, Senpai! Wow, Ring ist gut, das ist great. At first I thought I'd only ride it around town, so I didn't keep much gas in it. Ah, das Gespräch hatten wir ja alles schon mal. The hot springs. You came here with Risa. You hear a voice from the women's section of the hot springs. <laughs> oh, that echo was nice. I wonder if the staff would get upset if I sang in here. Ich hab zuerst gemeint, sie sagt wieder dasselbe. 
Come on. Awesome. Bei ihr ist es also wirklich nur so, dass die All-Out-Attack dann stärker wird. Ja, warum nicht? Monaco doesn't seem to be home. I'm home. Oh, welcome back. There was a letter in the mailbox for you. The letter is addressed to Mr. Valnir Asiason. But sender's name and address are nowhere to be found. There's only one sentence printed. Don't rescue anymore. Is it from a friend? Oh, my show is almost done. Don't rescue anymore. Could this be a warning from the killer? Or is it just a prank? You should discuss this with the troop tomorrow. So, sieht so aus, als wären wir herausgefunden worden. I'll protect you all from the madness of this world. I'll take you to a place where you can be at peace. Yes. It's much more peaceful than here. You showed everyone the letter you received yesterday. Don't rescue any more. Is this a warning? No punctuation or capitalization. Oh, what a cliche. Ain't this just a prank? The kind of stuff that only happens in the movies? Did you show this to your uncle? I don't plan to. Senpai, Dojima-san is trustworthy. But it may be best to keep this to ourselves. He will ask why you received such a letter. And if he were to put you under surveillance, our hands would be tied. If this letter is real, what's most important isn't what it says. It's the fact that it was delivered to the Dojima residence, addressed directly to you. This means the culprit knows in great detail who has been interfering with his crimes. And of all of us, he chose to deliver his message to the Dojima residence, home of a police detective. I'd have this letter checked at a crime lab if I could, but even then I doubt they'd find anything. The text is a warning, while the subtext expresses the culprit's confidence that we can't use it to pinpoint his identity. So it's useless to tell the police. In fact, that would make things worse. Cross your fingers, it's just a prank. I think the chances of that are slim. This message is too specific, too perfect to be a prank. But how could the killer know so much about us? Could he be watching us from somewhere? Teddy's been saying for a while that when we're over there, he senses someone watching us. Wait, every time we went to the other side to rescue someone, did we end up on the Midnight Channel ourselves? I don't know. It seems like no one else knows what we're doing. I haven't heard any rumors about us at school. Even the people who I know check that channel haven't said anything. The only gossip I heard was about the people who disappeared. I see. Come to think of it, how the Midnight Channel works is still a mystery. Let's put aside for now the matter of what that world truly is. There's too little data to go on. For now, we need to keep in mind that the culprit knows who we are. As long as we're all aware of that, it will be enough for now. Yeah, guess there's no use thinking about stuff we can't understand. 
Freaking out over speculation is just what the killer wants us to do, right? This could come in handy. Yeah. He told the others we'll have to wait until the situation changes. Alright, mind if I change the subject then? The culture festival's just around the corner. What's our class doing again? Oh yeah, it hasn't been decided yet, huh? I heard we'll be voting on it soon. But aren't they still gathering ideas? Whoa, I think Yosuke just got hit with a bolt of inspiration. Whatever it is, it'll be out there. I'd bet my lunch on it. Hey, Senpai. Have you decided who you'll be going around the campus with during the festival? My schedule's still wide open, you lucky guy. Oh, she just had to say something. Classes have ended for today. What uh, was that warning letter a prank? However, because you have no leads, you have no choice but to wait until something occurs. So, aber dann sollte ab jetzt halt Naoto gehen, hoffe ich. Sie ist aber auf jeden Fall mal nicht hier. Gehe ich trotzdem mal halt einfach runter, wenn nicht, können wir da ja mit Reese interagieren irgendwie. Shopping District North. Eher hier vielleicht, ja. Your. The man in black is looking at you as if appraising you. Do you know about luminal reactions? What part of the body do you use to test DNA? What's the best way to obtain someone's email address? What 10 things can you learn from footprints? The man is bombarding you with questions for some reason. With your unmatched knowledge, you answered every challenge smoothly and easily. I see, I see. You are quite an interesting young man. Do you know Naoto Sama? Uh, you know a detective by the name of Naoto Shirogana, correct? I do. Yes, I know you know him. Deliver this to him. He will understand. The man in black handed you something. You received a white card. Good day then. The man walked briskly away. This smells like a case. You should hand over to Naoto. So. Also Shopping District... ...ist dann halt vorbei für einen Moment. Er ist halt ja nicht da, oder sie, wie auch immer. Dann müssen wir damit halt noch warten und dann... ...verbringe ich den restlichen Tag halt mit Reese. If you're free, let's go play. Uh -huh. Yeah, where shall we go? Risa looks happy. Central Shopping District. You walked Risa home after a trip to Kina City. <laughs> I placed lots of special orders. Come with me next time when I go pick him up, Senpai. I had tons of fun today. Not many people tried to come up and talk. Maybe they all maybe they already forgot who I am. Oh yeah, want some tofu to take home? I helped them make them today. Wait right here. Excuse me, Wani san is it? Um sorry about the other day. I'm Minero Inu, Risa Kuchikawa's former manager. I'm sorry to bother you, but could you give this to her? Inu handed you a letter. A fan letter came, you see. Give it to her yourself. I don't think she'd take it for me. And Risa always did look forward to this girl's letter. In today's cult of personality, being popular carries in its own problems. Your schedule fits together, minute by minute, like a jigsaw puzzle. Every day you're squeezed utterly dry. 
but even knowing that, I still won't have a comeback. She was genuinely, genuinely brilliant. Uh, not only that, but she's strong enough to use her pain as a foundation. From what I could see, she's relying on you. So could you? Sorry, Senpai, but we are all sold out. You know, son, quit pestering me. Wait, what did you say to Senpai? I'm sorry, I'm leaving now. Goodbye. Holding him even after I quit, he's practically a stalker. To think I trusted him, I feel betrayed. He's worried about you. No. No, he just wants to set back. The me he created. Risa is biting her lip. So, what did he come for? You told Risa where Inuo came and handed her the fan letter. Oh. This letter. She wrote again. I see. But he came all the way out here for this. This girl is a middle school student. She writes to me all the time. I did this public service campaign once to stamp out bullying. She said it inspired her. She wrote that she wouldn't let bullies get her down. That she tried to make friends. Ever since then she wrote me letters. This happened to me today. I was able to say this. Stuff like that. Seeing your set rock hard encourages me. It makes me feel like I can still, still hang in there. Huh. She doesn't really know how it works, huh? But still, every time I read her letters, I felt like Reset actually meant something. So whenever things get tough, I would read them over and over. Senpai, do you still have some free time? Tatsuhime Shrine Risa seems to be deep in thought after reading the fan letter. She's worried about me. Obviously, I'm taking a break due to illness, so... Before I quit, there was... Talk about a part in a movie. She sounds like she... She sounds like she was really looking forward to it. Please get well soon and come back, she says. I'm so glad you were here. I was scared to read it alone. I gave up on being reset. I can't meet her expectations. She'll understand. Ah, not enough understanding, good. This was your decision. Yeah, you're right. Nothing can do about it now, huh? Risa is trying to smile. Anyway, Reset doesn't exist anymore. It's not just this girl. I disappointed lots of other people. The president of the company told me that over and over and I knew already. I knew this was the path I choose, but... <laughs> Maybe I'll just inherit a tofu shop. I'm the shop's main attraction now. I bet I could make it thrive. Senpai? Maybe you should really just do it, you know, what I was saying a while back. You could marry me once we graduate high school and the two of us could work at the tofu shop together. Doesn't that sound fun? Huh, how about it? If you're serious. If I'm serious? I think I'm pretty serious. You're always so calm. But I like that. <laughs> Risa is smiling sheepishly. Thank you, Senpai, for being with me all of today. I feel a bit better. Yeah, I'm fine. I can contribute something. And it look like and it looks like there are still plenty of things only I can do. You can sense Risa's quiet will. You feel that you understand Risa even more. The Risa Kujikawa social link has reached level 6. The power to create personas of the Lovers Arcana has grown. Risa's determination battle has been enhanced even further. She will now precisely identify an enemy's weakness. When you are 
when your options for attack include the enemy's weakness, Reese will inform you. Sorry for dragging you around all day. I'll let you go now. I'll see you later, you walked Reese to her house and went home. So, und da haben wir endlich den Partner an der Stelle. Wir sehen es wieder und wieder heißt. Let's play Persona 4 Golden. 